Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some products from Yamello. So we have the red, white, and blue star marshmallows. And then this is, looks really unique. This is Unicorn Cocoa Doker Marshmallows. And then I have the Fruit Mix Marshmallows and the Spicy and Sweet Marshmallows. So let me tell you a quick little story before we get started. Kevin and I had gone to Walmart uh, and we had bought these, these last three. three. Oh, yeah. all, all three of these, we bought them. I was so excited to find these. The spicy were $2.48 at Walmart. The other two were $3.98 at Walmart. We got home. There was a box on the front porch. It said Yum Mellow on the side. Of course. Yum Mellow has never sent me anything free before. Never. So I was absolutely shocked. They sent me a whole box of goodies, which included not these. I, they, they did not put these in their box, but they had these three plus so much more. So we're going to have another video with four more products from Yum Mellow. But I did, uh, I did get these completely free and it was just shocking because we had just bought these and it's like, oh my gosh, we have more. It so it was funny. Yeah, it was really funny how it worked out. So it was like, does that box say? I know. <laughs> but, like, yep, you know what? It, the good thing about <coughs> marshmallows, I think they're overlooked as far as a low calorie snack. Yeah. And you can walk down that aisle at Walmart and it smells terrific because you could smell all the, the marshmallows. Um, that and the bread aisle are one of my favorite aisles to mm -hmm. walk down. Because and the coffee. It, it's, and I like the coffee too because they <laughs> smell so good. Um, but they're a good low calorie snack. So these, I am assuming these are going to taste like regular marshmallows and they are just star shaped for uh, 4th of July. It says, uh, leave it to our star spangled marshmallows to give your favorite desserts a hearty dose of Americana. Smear them with grapes and cubes of pineapple, cantaloupe and watermelon to make patriotic fruit skewers. Roast them over the campfire for 4th of July flare, or turn them into celebratory cupcake toppers. Either way, they'll be the stars of the show. And it's spear, not smear. I think I said smear. It says spear them. I was wondering how you were going to smear them. <laughs> yeah, you spear them with, you know, on with a, a skewer. Yeah, with a skewer. Yeah, so that would be really pretty. So there are eight servings in the container. Six pieces, 30 grams, or 100 calories. Not bad. And these are a product of Holland, it says. They're distributed out of Chicago, Illinois, but a product of Holland. And I'm gonna cut it like this. So, and I'm assuming they're all gonna be the same flavor. What, what color are you gonna try? Red. Pink? The pink. Or one. pink, yeah. Just a marshmallow. Good marshmallow, though. Mm hmm Very fresh. Mm -hmm. This brand of marshmallow, is a little tougher and denser than the, like the jet puff or whatever I agree. um which maybe they mm -hmm. are but not necessarily in a bad way it just gives you something more to chew on yes um, they're i think chewier. it would last a little longer i would be curious i've never used one of these be curious to see how they toast yeah fire mm -hmm. because we, uh we don't toast marshmallows but no, but I love them. I uh, the, love, love, love a good toasted marshmallow. But those get really goopy in the middle. I would assume these would really get soft and goopy too, but probably not as much so. Well, they're smaller. Yeah. So uh, they're smaller, so I don't know how gooey they would get. I think these are more made for snacking than I for do roasting. Too. To me, these this brand has always seemed more like a snacking, mm. like sit on the couch, probably give them to the kids. No. Those would be good um, on hot chocolate too, though. Yes, because they, they are dense, they would take mm -hmm. longer to melt. Um, our grandkids, um, I don't. Uh, to other grandparents out there, uh, you might like hearing this if you don't know. Uh, like I said, I think marshmallows are overlooked. Um, our grandkids love marshmallows. Love them. You can buy a bag of marshmallows and put them in like one of those red cello cups, and they can carry them around the house. They don't get sticky. The little mini ones. Exactly. Yeah, they don't get sticky or, or anything like that. And uh, they absolutely love them. Uh, so these sounded unique to me. These are the Unicorn Cocoa Dunker Marshmallows. Fluffy marshmallows covered 
in real milk chocolate and topped with colorful sprinkles. Not just for cocoa, try them in s'mores, sundaes, and more. It's four servings are in the container, three pieces are 130 calories. So I knew we weren't gonna be trying them with hot chocolate. I knew we would just try them like the way they come out of the package. But, it but just, you could put them in the Absolutely. So I, I wonder how big, oh, they're bigger than I thought. Yes, they're diamond shaped. That's not bad at all. Yeah, and these are stuck together. So, well, here, go ahead. We'll get that. Do you want to? You want to bite it? Yeah, bite it in half. But yeah, they're they're really festive. I like the crunch. Yeah, I like that. The, the you still get that sweetness of the marshmallow, the mm -hmm. tough uh, chewiness of the marshmallow, but then it's got like a crisp. Mm -hmm. Chocolate on the outside, that's really good. And it's, I mean, it's, is it gourmet chocolate? No, but is it good chocolate? Yeah, it's it good is chocolate. good chocolate. And once again, I would eat these by themselves. I would too. That's just me. I mean, you could put them hot cocoa and let them melt, but you don't have to. It is, um, it's a little bit darker than milk. Yeah, it does have a strong chocolate flavor, though. You really do. do. I mean, really, the, the chocolate's the star of the yeah. show for yeah. me. Yeah, the marshmallow just adds sweetness. Yeah. But uh, I could eat that whole bag in one sitting. That's the only problem. Uh, there's only 12 pieces. <laughs> How many do you get for one third? Three. Three, yeah. Uh, but, so That's I pretty could, good though. I could go through the whole bag, but uh, they could do different toppings. They could do a caramel topping. I would love to see one with peanut butter. Mm, uh, good. But those are delicious. Yeah, they're good. Okay, so now we have the fruit mix. So it says natural and artificially flavors, gluten-free, non-GMO, fat-free. We have lemon, strawberry, orange, and watermelon. So four different flavors, I'm excited. 10 servings are in the container. Six pieces are 110 calories. How oh, but they're big. Those are big marshmallows. Oh, they smell good. It smells almost like a bowl of cereal. Oh, they're cute. They're very cute. I know, I sound like a little girl. <laughs> They they are cute though. Well, watermelon. That's cute. I'm assuming that's watermelon. That's cute. That's adorable. Yes. Yeah, that's what I got. Okay. So this is your lemon. And it's it like little lemon like dots in there. Let's see. This is an orange. I would think so. And There's we'll, one more. This should be strawberry, right? Oh, this one. That's yeah. so cute. Oh, it's like a little. Oh, it is a strawberry. It's just a really big. Pop on green part. <laughs> yeah, yeah, those are cute. Those are adorable. Okay, so which one you want to try first? Or do, do you think we should eat one by ourselves? Or do or do you think oh, we'll get the... Oh, yeah, I think the flavor is the whole Okay, we okay. Can buy one half. Just okay, it. I'm going to do strawberry. Go for it. Now, I think the flavor is all through it. Hmm, those are a little softer. That's so cute. Those are softer than the stars. Mm-hmm. And well, it's funny because the, these we bought from the store and the stars were sent directly from the company. Maybe they were just, they're smaller. Yeah, they I, said I, they're just made different. Yeah, they're, they're a smaller marshmallow. So that's, I think, why they were uh, a little chewier. Not that that's a bad thing. It's just different. These are more like your traditional Marshmallow. marshmallows. Yeah. Um, I like the strawberry flavor. I do too. Um, I feel like I got other fruits mixed in yeah. with it. Uh, lemon. That's the only bad thing about when they're in a bag together. Sometimes they get kind of cross-contaminated. Mm -hmm. You do taste the what you do taste what it's supposed to be, mm -hmm. but I do have to say it's light. Yeah, that lemon flavor is light, but it tastes like it's mixed with watermelon. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Did you get a little watermelon? Yeah. yeah. This is orange. These are they're still fun to eat. Mm -hmm. I think so too. I wonder what you could do with these. What flavor was that? That was orange. orange. That and was you, pretty light. It was, I mean, it was very, rare. very light. I'm wondering how you could like decorate with these besides just You could stick them, them on the like, top of a cupcake. Oh yeah, you could. Like that? Yeah. Or even a cake. If you wanted to stick around on a cake, you could. Yeah. Okay, this is watermelon. I think the watermelon's been the strongest flavor. It has. Just know, these are adorable. Very, very cute. They're light though. It's not candy. So yeah, it's not yeah, going to be strong. Yeah, you definitely not eat candy. 
Yeah, it's not gonna be as strong as candy. I do think you're gonna get the flavor. You might get other fruits mixed in with it because it's been in the bag together. Um, but you get a ton. Mm -hmm. uh, three ninety eight. You're getting a, a big bag of these. Uh, you know, these are them. these are a nice little. Um, if you want something a little sweet that's not overly sweet, these are really nice for that. Yeah. I, I think they're great. I would give these to the to the grandkids. Mm -hmm. uh, this is spicy and sweet. Uh, six pieces, 110. I'm hoping, now I don't know. I'm hoping they'll taste like cinnamon. But you I don't know. It's like hot. Yeah. Can't tell. These look like just marshmallows. Mm, I know. They don't smell like cinnamon. I can't like tell. They smell like, yes, like a hot pepper. I agree. Dark chocolate pairs perfectly with the sweet and spicy flavors of these marshmallows. Hmm. There's a little burn. It takes a minute. It does take, it's very, very, and it's light. Uh, it's not like a hitch in the face heat, um, but it is, Heat, it's not cinnamon. It's not no, cinnamon flavor. Although cinnamon. that would have been nice. It's I know, I love flavor. cinnamon. I love like red hots and yeah. fire, atomic fireballs. Maybe not that strong, but it would have been yeah. nice to have a little bit of cinnamon. Yeah, I would love a cinnamon marshmallow. These are basically marshmallows with whatever they make to just make heat um, with just a yes. little bit of that. Yes. So I have no idea when people are eating those. If you like hot food, you might want a little sweet with a little heat, you know. Right, just to snack on, just like any yeah. of the other ones. Yeah, yeah. But these are these are shaped. These are like a a bullet. <laughs> yeah, like, they, these are just like regular marshmallows. Yeah, they're like a regular marshmallow. Yeah. Uh, which one would you buy all the time? Um, to just to snack on. Yes. Um, the stars. Probably or the fruit ones or the fruit ones. Yeah, I like the size of the fruit ones and I like that the fruit ones have the more traditional uh, Texture, texture. Uh, the the stars the stars are really good, but they are smaller and denser. They're chewier yeah, yeah. Just know that um, I love these though. The chocolate ones are really, really would you pick that as one of your um, One of your ones though to eat all the time. I know but I really do like I them. do like them uh, the only thing is, the only reason why I wouldn't pick them is because I'm greedy and I'm gluttonous and there's not as many in here. Yeah. There, I know if I buy these, they're not going to last me as That's long true. when these are going to last me for days and days. Yeah. So honestly, I would probably choose the fruit one because you get so much, but I really do like the chocolate covered ones because, you honestly, know. Honestly, I like all of them. Yeah, they're but all good. This one's probably not for me because I don't like things to be hot just to be hot. That's a novelty, I yeah. think. For, no, if you like hot food. If you like those Tabasco candy bars and yes. they get into that kind of food, then that's for these. you. Yeah. But um, and they're not that hot, but they they do give you a little tingle. But this is one I would probably would never get. But any of those would be great. Yes, absolutely. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.